Hello guys, welcome to penetrating testing with Spirit. My name is Spirit Edward and today I'm going to show you how you can configure your verb suit in your Kali Linux. So let's start. Open your terminal and type here B U R P S U I T suit. And you can also go to applications, Kali Linux, then click on the top 10 security tools, then click on the second option that is verb suit. So you can open from the terminal or from here. So let's open from manually. So this is really a very good tool for performing the penetrating testing. So let's start configuring our verb suit in our Kali Linux. So now go to the interior and as you can see our host name is 127.0.0.1 and the port is 8080 so just remove 80 and enter 8080 and then open your browser and then go to your browser settings and then go to the advanced option and then click on the network and then click on the connection settings it's right here now as you can see there are a lot of options for our for using the proxy so just click on the manual proxy configuration and here just type 127.0.0.1 as we have done in the verb suit configuration and then here just type 8080 as we write in our port name and then click on ok and then close it and in the new in the new tab just type http slash slash verb b u r p and then just hit enter so it means we have successfully configured our proxy in our browser so now just go to the CA certificate and then click on CA certificate and then save file so as you can see it's downloaded so now just move the file to the desktop so now again go to the settings and this time click on the certificates option in the advanced session and then click on the view certificates of the browser so it's right here view certificates then click on it so a new pop-up shows the certificate manager so now click on the import option now just go to the desktop because we have moved our file to the desktop and here is the certificate file that is the that is with the extension of ber so select it and then open it and then select all the options all the three options that is showing so now just click on ok and then again ok and then close it so we have successfully configured our verb suit so now go to the verb suit and then click on the second option that is proxy and first make it up. and as you can see um, let me search for read time first so i can show you how it works
as you can see we got the request from the server so as you can see so if we forward it then it will forward our request to the server as you can see here so now like we have for simple column so now just type here Okay. So thanks for watching guys and I hope you like this video.